Hey YouTube, it's Pogo Sticks 333 here, and today I'm going to show you how to get free music videos on your iPod. It's really easy. You want to start by going to Google. And you want to search for Vixie, V I X Y. And the top result should do it. I'll put a link in the description. You should be brought to this site, and this is the um, where this box here is where you're going to put the URL in that you want to convert. Okay, next, open a new tab and go to YouTube. And you want to find the video you want on your iPod. So once you've found your video that you want to put on your iPod, you go to the URL box, which is here, and you copy and paste the whole thing into this box on Vixie. Once it's there, you want to click on this little arrow here and choose what format you want. You can have AVI for Windows, MOV for Mac, MP4 for iPod, PSP, M3GP for mobile, and MP3 audio only. Because we want the video for iPod, we're going to go for MP4 for iPod. Once you've done that, click on Start. It's connecting to the server. Um, it depends, if your internet speed is fast, then this won't take as long as it is on mine, because my connection is average, so it might take a little longer than it might do for you. Now it's resolving the video URL and starting the conversion. And this blue bar will go across the, the box. Done about fifty five per cent now. Okay, once it's done, uh, you'll get this link here. What you want to do is click on it, and you don't want to open it, you want to press save. So click on save and save it where you want and give it a name, not all these funny uh, numbers and letters. And click on save once you've given it a name. It's going to save it. <sighs> Nearly there now. Okay, once it's done you can close that window and then you can close off the internet and now you want to go to iTunes once iTunes is open go to the movies section and click on file add file to library now find find your um, where you saved your video. And there it is. Click on it and select open. Your file is now in the library. Yes. 
Let's convert it all through. Okay, so now you've added it to your library, you can easily add it to your iPod. Okay, thanks for watching. Please comment.